So today we'll do a sketch of uh, Zoe Zebra, Zebra. So I'll teach you the simple steps how to make a Zoe Zebra sketch. So you'll have, uh, I think, a major portion. There are two portions. One is head and one is the body. So you can draw a simple oval. So. So, so use a H or 2H pencil for drawing an outline. Okay. So make it a little bit tapered towards the mouth. So here comes the nose portion and uh, here is the mouth and you have ears, here yeah, sorry eyes so the, here you have ears and on the top of for the second eye, you can draw another ear. And here you have stripes. So zebra has black and white stripes, so we can draw like this. And which will cover one eye. The second after second eye is in cross like this. So this is a face, the rough sketch of uh, the Zoe zebra face. And then so at this section, so if you, if you assume this is uh, 50 half and this is quarter, so from here, actually you need to draw a mountain shape. This is dress. You can join this. So you should rub the, the extra portion, so this way So you can rub it You can join the stripes again back Okay So you have now, you need to draw the hands, there are two hands Sorry I made it a bit longer So there are three fingers and this way is three fingers and you have the leg and you have a tail so in my previous videos of Peppa and Suzy so the tail was very small and but here Zoe Zebra has a bigger tail so it has to be like this and it should branch out in this form. So currently you can make it as like this, then we can do a, some sort of uh, shading. Okay, this is an outline. So next you can take uh, 2B or HP, I'm taking uh, 2B for your reference. So what I'll do is I'll just uh, darken out what I have drawn as rough sketch. So make sure that you darken it properly and no errors because once you darken it it's difficult to correct it okay okay so then you darken the shoes and the legs So at the face you should be very careful, so, so draw always the fish should be like in the old shape in the curvy form, there shouldn't be any sharp edges, make sure that. So okay. okay, here I have made one error, so it has to be in a curvy form, so make sure that it's like this and you draw and join here. 
okay so darken the two eyes and uh, darken the eyeballs so two ears so here there's one difference uh, compared to the band uh, so the ears so you need to darken the one uh, ear completely as it has a black mark so next comes the nose so we have two small circles here so then the mouth portion smiley and here you need to make it uh, stripes as zebra has black and white stripes okay so and again here okay okay now you can start uh, making it black black and white so I've taken 2B for making it black so what you can do is you can start from the one edge as you already have the outline so it's easier just fill up the the area which is covered between these two lines make sure that eyes are not touched like it is be careful when you do a shading here the eye portion So make it uniform, you make sure that the strokes, what you apply, for example, if you are applying the horizontal stroke, so the throw the drawing, it has to be like horizontal, you shouldn't change the strokes, it has to be like this. Okay, and next is and this portion so we start from here and uh, try to maintain the same stroke yeah. so here I'm using the vertical strokes it has to be in the same fashion okay so then uh, this portion you have black and white strips here on the hand and uh, even the palm has to be uh, black right so even here this has to be black and this hand portion has to be sort of black okay so the leg portion this portion has to be dark and this one has to be dark and the shoes has to be dark and the other shoes also has to be dark make sure that you don't leave any empty spaces within the closed figure like how I am filling up it should be a complete uh, fill up and the tail it has to be completely dark so what you can do is uh, you can do like this and do like this and do like this and do like this okay this comes to you so in the dress portion also you can uh, do some shading as I'm uh, doing the sketching there's no color applied on the dress actually in the real picture it may be a pink in color so what you can do is at the edge of uh, the dress you can make it darker and apply lower pressure towards the center so that it's in the lighter shade like this So on the same side, uh, you just need to turn this way and make sure Okay, so I'm 
not applying the pressure at this moment so that it is on the very light side. So once you move towards end and making it putting more pressure, so it's darken. Okay, then you can use the HP pencil just to make sure that it's you complete the shading so wherever there's open spaces white spaces you can just fill it up you can make some corrections and to uh, use again towards the end you can keep this as a the darker shades So observe that the stroke has to be in the same uh, direction. For example, here I'm doing the stroke in this direction. So I need to maintain the stroke, the same stroke till the, the middle portion, and again it has to be in the other way. That's exactly right. Okay, so now I think we are almost done. So just make sure that the ears are a bit darker and the nose, yeah, sorry, and what else? This nose portion make it dark, this is also a bit dark, and the uh, other inside portion a bit lighter shade. Okay, so here fill it up with a lighter shade, and even here, this ensure, make sure that it's filled up with a lighter shade, and even here, like it's a muzzle or skin of uh, soy zebra and the mouth portion you can bit darken it so make it thick and make sure that it's make it in a curved form there shouldn't be any edges because it's a smiling and it's a smiley face Okay, I think we are almost uh, done. So, Zoe Zebra looks great to me. Right? So, I'll say as uh, so Zebra. Okay. Okay, hope uh, you enjoyed the session. So I'll be making more uh, the character of cartoon characters in my future videos. Yeah, just watch out. Hope uh, this will be helpful for you to do some sketching of your favorite characters at home. Okay, thank you. Have a good day. Bye-bye.